Housewives of New York City, star Bryn Whitfield revealed her feelings about her castmate, Jenna Lyons, have changed. During an October 2023 appearance on Vanderpump Rules, personality Sheena Shea's podcast, Sheenanigans with Sheena Shea, Whitfield acknowledged that she would flirt with Lyons while filming Roni season 14. She explained that initially, her crush on Lyons was not genuine. It's like when you were little and I'm like the class clown and she's like the shy kid. So, I like making people blush. And I can make Jenna blush. So it just starts off like that. And I like poking the bear. When we were filming, it was more of a joke, and it's like I like to make her blush, I like to make jokes, said the 37-year-old. Whitfield stated that she developed a genuine crush on Lyons after watching Roni season 14, which premiered in June 2023. She also noted that the former president of J. Crew is in a relationship with photographer Cass Bird. The craziest thing though a few weeks ago, I'm watching it back and then Jenna and I have become close now too. And she's very happy and in a relationship, she's so happy. And her partner's amazing, said Whitfield. I started thinking about it, I'm like, you know what, honest to God, like why not? Like why didn't I? I just told her like we were at this party last week, you know what's funny, like when we were filming, we were joking, now I actually kind of have a crush on you. Bryn Whitfield stated she is, kind of in love with, with her castmate while recording the, Sheenanigans with Sheena Shea, episode, Whitfield explained that Lyons, checks all, her, boxes, when it comes to a romantic partner. She then compared her situation with Lyons to the clueless character Cher Horowitz, Alicia Silverstone, realizing she had romantic feelings for Josh Lucas, Paul Rudd. It's like you have a best friend, and you are like, wait a second, I'm in love with Josh, like you know like, clueless, reference. That's what I had with Jenna. I had an, I'm in love with Josh, moment. I was like, wait, but actually, I could have been with her during Paris Fashion Week, it could have been me, her, and Usher. I'm like, what a perfect life, said Whitfield. The Roni star went on to that, the older, she, get, s, the more, she does not, care about gender, in terms of dating. She stated that she, missed out, on a chance with Lyons. If you are nice, and kind, and funny, and successful, and have a house in the Hamptons and a boatload of f asterisk 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 money, I'm interested. Like who cares? She's hot. And she's so kind and loving, stated Whitfield. And she's so good with me, and patient with me, and so loving with me. She's always sending me little things, like, this reminds me of little Bryn. My brother loves her. Like it's now, like I'm kind of love with Jenna. It was a joke then and now I'm kind of in love with Jenna. But it's the story of my life, I'm too late. Jenna Lyons shared her thoughts about Bryn Whitfield's flirtatious behavior during the production of the Roni season 14 reunion special. Lyons shared that she did not believe Whitfield was genuinely interested in her, despite her constant flirting. I think Bryn is very straight, said the fashion designer. During an October 2023 interview on, Watch What Happens Live with Andy Cohen, Lyons asserted that she did not mind Whitfield's flirtatious behavior. Have you looked at her? said Lyons. In the same, Watch What Happens Live with Andy Cohen, interview, Lyons addressed rumors that she and Bird are engaged. Here's the story, my girlfriend, who I adore, kept telling me I had to button my shirt. 
I said, if you want to button my shirt, you have to put a ring on it. We're just really happy. And she gave me the ring that I wanted. I am very happy, said the mother of one. Jenna Lyons spoke about starring on Roni in a July 2023 interview on The View. Lyons shared she appreciates having the chance to be open about her sexuality as a lesbian while starring in a Bravo series. She explained that when she was the president of J. Crew, some employees would tell her their parents were worried about their futures because of their sexuality. One of the things I experiences when I was at J. Crew was I had a lot of young kids coming to me, and their parents thought they weren't going to be successful, stated Lyons. They were like, my mom is so relieved to see someone successful who is openly gay. And for some reason they thought it was going to limit them or they wouldn't be happy. They couldn't find success in career or happiness and love. Those things just aren't true. And I think having someone they can look up to and be like, listen, this person is surviving in the world, they're doing fine. I'm thriving. And that gives a lot of parents who are scared a little bit more confidence. Quote, 